Hello, everybody. I would like to welcome you to the Fellow Travelers Podcast. Today, I want to discuss an idea that I've been ruminating on here lately. And that's the understanding that we're all travelers. Now, as we go through this reality, universe, life, what have you, whatever you choose to call it, there's a realization that as we travel, we collect souvenirs as travelers do. That's metaphorically speaking, of course. It's not that we go somewhere, we bring a keychain back and now we're a traveler. It's the understanding of the wisdom, knowledge, or even experience that we gain from simply taking the journey. Now we all do return to the source from which we came from birth to death. But when we're born, we start a journey. And along that journey, we grow, we evolve. And the only way we grow and evolve is by going through experiences. As we go through those experiences, we pick up habits, beliefs, concepts. Those, those are the souvenirs. Sometimes souvenirs can be people. It can merely be things. But those concepts and beliefs are those souvenirs that we either choose to or choose not to let go of. For myself, that's interesting because If I'm being quite honest, I took on a an especially exciting aspect of my journey many times when I was able to see those souvenirs that have been sitting in my blind spot or that I got used to carrying. I'm of the belief that I was unable to travel lightly or travel in a different fashion until I let those souvenirs go. Sometimes they can get heavy, the things that we accumulate over the years. So in letting go of some of those souvenirs, beliefs, concepts, my surroundings became clearer. I was no longer connected more so to that environment of thinking and even my physical environment because I let some souvenirs go. It opened up a brand new world for me. It was as if holding on to those souvenirs forced me to travel a certain way. And by letting go, I was able to make different choices, see a different reality, see different roads to travel on see paths that had not been created yet. I share this with you fellow travelers because through my own experience, I understand how empowering it can be and also how scary it can be. I champion any of you to take inventory of those souvenirs that you hold on to. Because you may realize, like I did, that depending on the travelers that you align yourself with, (laughs) you may be able to change your perspective of what souvenirs are truly meaningful to you. Now we all essentially walk alone. That's just, hey, that's how it is. Well, we find comfort in finding fellow travelers. But when you're understanding, or when you get to a better understanding, I should say, of your path, then you honor those travelers that are with you in the moment for whatever reason. You also honor those travelers that are with you for the season. You do not hold judgment. 
you embrace it for what it is, all while understanding that while you're on your own individual journey, those travelers too are on their journey. While you understand that they are souvenirs for you, you can also honor that you are a souvenir for them. Something to think about. So as you move forward and you think about some beliefs that you hold dear to, remember that you don't owe any loyalty to any souvenir. The souvenir, the thought, the idea, the concept, it's only valuable because you give it the power. And by realizing that you are the source that provides the value to things in your reality, you can change it. It's not always simple, but it's quite easy. With those things said, these are the thoughts that I have to share at the moment. I look forward to speaking to you fellow travelers and sharing more insights. And hopefully, here's some insights of yours as well. Until then, be blessed.